Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and call this training Next Level Missed Call Text Back. Well, first of all, Missed Call Text Back is just awesome in and of itself, right? You, you miss a call, someone's driving, they're on a ladder or whatever, and you and they automatically text you back. Like that's alone is a game changer. What I found was that that still wasn't enough. Like the, the, the client's customer would text them back and my client would still not follow up with them. I'm like, this is a hot lead, right? So as you can see here, here's an example. So I get the notification come through, hey, they called this number uh, and it wasn't answered and it went to voicemail. So that alone will, will trigger the missed call text back. And then I'm thinking, well, what if they replied? Is it still gonna just sit there and go stale? Like four hours later, it's like you, you, you've kind of now pretended to be there. I just texted you back. And then they text you back to that and then, you, and then it falls silent, right? Like that's just a bad experience. It's kind of like, well, what's going on here? Okay, so now it's like, hey, 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 they texted you back. Like, please, like, get in there, jump in there and, and you know, jump into this conversation that you, we've kind of automatically started for you. This is a hot lead. And so I basically, now I text my client, the cut my customer, saying that his customer just texted back and I actually copy the body of that message to him in the, in the, uh, his, the text to him. And then also uh, dynamically generates a link back to that same contact record so he could jump in there and um, you know make notes or, or whatever else, okay? So I'll show you how to do that here. Here's the thing though. You also have two choices when it comes to setting up missed call text back. Here in the company settings, business info at the bottom, missed call text back. At a minimum, yeah, you would want to just enable that. And then um, you, know, you can put your, little, put your little piece of text there and do that. I have found that if you want to be a little bit smarter about this, then you're going to want to do this in a workflow. Okay. You're going to have a lot more uh, options at your disposal. Another quick thing that I really like is, uh, is just knowing, you know, that you can have multiple phone numbers, right. For different things. Like if I have a Google, my business profile, if I have ads running, uh, if I have um, Facebook ads, YouTube ads, whatever print mail, you could have, you know, just, um, have multiple numbers for the different things that really helps with the tracking. Okay. So I have this workflow and basically what it is, it comes into a certain phone number and I, uh, I create an opportunity. Okay. Even off of a missed call, it's an opportunity. I assign it to a user. I add a tag. I wait a bit. I text myself. So I know that a lead came in. I text, um, <clears throat> I reply back to the customer. This is the, this is the standard missed call text back. Hey, it's Dan with so-and-so. I saw we missed your call. How can we help? <clears throat> I also put that little thing in there. I try to make, not make it robotic, but just saying, Hey, if you prefer not to text, you can reply stop at any time. Okay. So it gets that keyword that's kind of required. It's that first text to them. Um, so that, that's where we kind of, that's where we, that's where I originally started was just, was just with that. And then I was like, once I saw the problem, I thought, let, how can we fix this to make it a little bit smarter? So then I said, let's go ahead and wait up to four hours. And then this is the kicker here is if the contact replied, if contact replied uh, equals yes, right? So if they did, then let's do one thing. If they didn't, right? If they haven't replied in four hours, I'm actually gonna text the customer really quickly again. Hey, anything I can do to help? Just a real quick, like a follow-up, right? But if they do reply, that's when that's when I um, will kind of do that next level step, which is, hey, they just replied back to you. This is what they said. It's uh, message.body. And then as far as the, uh, as far as the, um, the trick here to your, your link is basically uh, every contact has a, you have your base URL, you have your location, right? And then you have contacts and then right here you use contact ID and that's what will put that deep link into your system. Uh, so it will go right into, so for example, if I click this here, it's going to go right into that contact record. So that is next level miss call text back. You could probably do even more cool things from that, but, uh, yeah, you can see, Hey Dan, this is Nick from Ramada sports. Ramada Sparta, did you get a chance to quote and see that that text gets copied right there.
So hopefully that helps someone out there. Let me know if you found this helpful. Thanks so much. Take care.